A lot of times he used to tail and make sure everybody was, was where they were supposed to be, and I thought that was fantastic, just well, you, fantastic. When you talk about motivation, uh, what were some ways that you found worked better, I guess, than other ways to motivate the young kids to, uh, to get out there and perform better? Well, when, when you talk about how to motivate kids, I think a lot of people would like to think there's some magic formula in that. There isn't. And there isn't. Uh, you can try a lot of stuff. And heaven knows I probably did. <laughs> I probably tried a lot of stuff psychologically. But I found over the years, uh, and this is, this is tough to say, but I think it's hitting the nail on the head. If the kid is motivated, you're in good shape. And if he's not, all you can do is try to motivate him. But okay. most of the time, uh, you're hoping for self-motivation because that's always better. Sure. Uh, and, and, and we've tended to have a lot of self-motivated kids right here in Romeo. I'm dealing with run, one right now, Andy Stebbins. I don't oh, yeah. know if I could find a more motivated kid. Uh, you know, practicing four or five or six days a week isn't enough for this kid. He's got to practice seven days a week, and on top of practice, he's got to pump iron for another four or five days, and on and on and on. And I can't tell you how many people I have standing around the field event saying, boy, I, I want to be like Andy. And basically, it's yeah. verbal. It's verbal. You look at him and say, yeah. well, oh, I want to be like that guy. Yeah, but I want to be like that to guy. And, and you say to them, okay, let, let's talk about what he does to get where he's at and what he's done over the last four years. He gets up at four in the morning, he's jogging it's, at five. It's astounding, that's it's cool. astounding, yeah. absolutely yeah. astounding. And, and, and just throwing that out for a second, I know it's off the topic, it's so astounding that a lot of his mid-season performances weren't particularly good because here this kid is performing but he's in the midst of all this other stuff that he's doing physically. We knew that ultimately it would pay off because our whole goal is the last 10 days of the season. Okay. We're looking to peak for the conference meet, the regional, the county, and the state. And so far, the first three have gone really, really well. Good. And now we're going to state, and hopefully we can get a, a fourth peek at that meet. And you'll let but us know. We'll get it on the, on the sports when sure. you do. Okay. Sure. Okay. Sure. Gentlemen, I thank you very much. Congratulations. Mike. Thank you very Tim, much. Thanks, also, Mark. congratulations. Thank you. Pleasure. I'm glad you guys Pleasure. come in to do this again. <laughs> and uh, for Channel 6 Sports, that's it.